two PhDs, science for kids. So, animals including humans, animals including humans need to eat to get all the energy and nutrients they need. Carbohydrates, these are the main source of energy for our bodies. They make us run fast. Meep, meep. Fats. Fat are stored by the body for energy, provide a layer of fat or warmth. Fat keeps you warm, right? That's how polar bears live in the Antarctica. Proteins build and repair body tissue muscles and organs and the immune system. Vitamins and minerals. Keeping our bodies working and growing properly and help to fight out of the infections. A balanced diet. You, you should try to eat a varied diet, which includes all of the food groups. Avoid eating too much fatty or sugary food. They may cause tooth decay. I can tell you the four groups of the plate. There's five, but one of them isn't in the big plate. There's one small one. Fruits, vegetables, proteins, and grains. Don't forget the little boy dairy. It's the skeleton. The skull protects the brain. It's a part of the skeleton. The shoulder joins from this part of your body to this part of your body. The elbow, a joint from this part of your body to this part. The ribs protect your heart and lungs. That's why when you fall here, you don't really get hurt because of your ribs. The knee, it joins your one part of your body to another. The pelvis, it's where your, uh, like you know when you, where your wrist is, but on your, like next your private, yeah, that's the part. And the backbone. The backbone helps, helps you to move your hands, your legs, and your back. If this part, th this part of your bone breaks, you can, you only do is this. Ah. Vertebrates and invertebrates. Vertebrates are, are a living organism which has a backbone. Like us, we are vertebrates. A horse is a vertebrate, dogs are vertebrates, but invertebrates are animals that do not have a single bone or have an exoskeleton. Exoskeleton means they have a skeleton but outside their body. Imagine if we had that. It would be silly. <laughs> Butterflies, they're invertebrates, worms, and the jellyfish, they are invertebrates.